And finally, for today's episode, let's turn to David Trim for a look at Adventist history. During this week, 113 years ago, May 10 through 20, 1902, the Brazil Conference was organized in Gaspar Alto in the Brazilian state of Santa Catarina. H.F. Graf, a German-American missionary from Minnesota, was elected the first president. The conference comprised 19 Adventist congregations with a total of 742 members. There are now eight separate unions in Brazil and as of December 31st, 2014, they comprised 16,440 congregations and 1,519,038 church members. Truly, mighty oaks have grown from that original acorn. On May 11, 1887, a party of pioneer missionaries left New York City. Two ministers, Doris A. Robinson and Charles L. Boyd, and their wives, Edna Robinson and Maud Sisley Boyd, sailed for Cape Town, accompanied by a Bible instructor, Miss Carrie Mace, and two coal porters, George Burley and R.S. Anthony. These were the first Adventist missionaries to be sent to South Africa, where they arrived in July. The same date, the 11th of May, but 45 years later in 1922, was the first day of the 40th General Conference session held in San Francisco. Arthur G. Daniels had been General Conference President for 21 years, a record, but was not re-elected at this session. The Secretary, William A. Spicer, was elected in his place. Daniels was bitterly disappointed, but he went on to play a leading role in creating the Ministerial Association, while Spicer provided strong, mission-focused leadership as President for eight years. That was This Week in Adventist History. 